Hey there, beers. Adela here, and welcome to my newest Let's Play. The Steam Summer Sale Monster Game. I am totally kidding. This is a terrible idea for the Summer Sale, and I kind of got sick of sitting here clicking things, so I decided to make a macro that'll do it for me. And I thought some of you guys might be interested in the same thing, so I'll show you how to do it. All right, so this is really, really easy to do. And I'm going to show you exactly how easy. You need two things. First, you need a program called AutoHotKey. And second, you need a script that runs within AutoHotKey that tells your mouse what to do. So go to your web browser and type in AutoHotKey. And right at the very top, AutoHotKey.com. When you click the download button, it'll give you the exe to install AutoHotKey. So go ahead and do that. I already have mine installed, so I don't need to, obviously. After you have it installed, don't hit run because it doesn't have anything to run yet. It doesn't have a script. So, me, I'm not a scripter. I didn't know what the heck to do to get my mouse to go really fast. But, go figure, someone on the internet did. And that fella happened to be named Nimda from the AutoHotKey forums. And he posted a whole different slew of ways you can get this to work. I personally found the toggle option to be most appropriate for this, where you press the button, it goes for a while, and then you can press the button to stop it. So, all you do after you install AutoHotKey is right click on your desktop or wherever you want to put the script at, go to New, and then AutoHotKey Script. And you're always going to have that prompt as long as you have AutoHotKey installed. First thing it wants you to do is name it. And I will name it Clicker without the capital L. When you double click on this, it literally does nothing because there's no information in the script yet. So we go to edit script, clear out their warnings because we're not actually writing anything. We're not developers, who are we can Hit control V and this is the exact script that I pulled from Ninja's post on the forum. So as you can see here, the default key to start the script is F8. I leave it as that because why not? And then it tells the script to click every 100 milliseconds. I find 100 milliseconds to be quite slow, so I set mine to 30. Sometimes going faster like this can cause a lot of lag problems in Steam, and you may want to consider sticking it higher, maybe 50, 75, 100, somewhere in there instead, especially if you're just getting endless lag and it's not really worth it. However, on a game like Clicker Heroes, which I'm assuming is completely offline, you can probably go all the way up to like 10 milliseconds and not have any problem. So after you save the script, you can just leave it where you made it, double click, and now an instance of auto hotkey will be running down here, right there. So we will pull open our Steam Summer game. I'm dead because obviously I haven't been at the computer for a minute or two, well, at the game. And we will hit respawn. And all we do is hold our mouse over what we want to attack. And instead of spamming click like this, we just tap F8 and let it do the work for us. I gotta tell you, this isn't exactly fun, which sort of puts into perspective why I don't understand how people enjoy hacking on multiplayer games other than to annoy people. So let me just iterate a point here. Don't use this in an environment where it's going to impact other people's gameplay negatively or positively. In this case, you could say that I'm impacting someone else's gameplay in a positive manner, but let's be serious. This isn't really impacting anything because judging by the lag that I'm getting right now, I'm not even hurting this monster, <laughs> but seriously, don't take it on the like Counter-Strike or something and have super fire or something like that. I don't even know if that would work, but use this like a decent individual. So if you found this helpful, or if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below and I will get right back with you and give you a hand as much as possible. Obviously, I don't know too much about this, but I know enough to get it going. And if you liked it, then drop me a like. And if you just don't give a shit, then get out. I don't want you here. Please stay, though. Please.